effectively, Slash can probably be the most powerful champion in the game. Correct. Thank you for I agree. thank you thank you for yeah certifying that what I'm saying is not total garbage. Sap to zoto. <laughs> uh, we've got the champion picks going. Visor picked by both players. Uh, of course, we've got the slash for Cypher. We've got Nyx for Sparty. Uh, I'm curious about the last one, actually, because this is where I usually get stuck in Blood Covenant when I'm picking champions on this patch. Nyx by Cypher. Galena. And yeah, of course, you're right. Nyx on the Cypher. Well, I'm Galena not... is, like, interesting. Yeah. I don't but know I how feel I feel about that. It can work versus more kind of passive players. That's why I don't think it will work versus Cypher. But it's always good because if you play versus someone who is up for some rail trading and like distance damage, you can like get some totems around some cheeky corners and you can restack really fast because of totems. But other than that, I don't see why Galena can work. We saw from base in the OK challenge as well, using Galena on Blood Covenant with the plus forward mechanic, like making doing crazy stuff on the bounce pads. Yeah, but like BJ can do the same, so and Nyx can do the same, fly on gem pads too. That's true. I think Nyx is only limited to like 400 UPS of that mechanic. I think it's quite difficult with her, isn't it? Still, you can do it from jump pad to other side of yeah. the third floor. Fair enough. Well, guys, we're at the second winner bracket semi-final underway. I'm actually going to switch over to Cypher because we've not seen him at all today. He's going up versus Sparty. Maestro Sparty, that is, and uh, versus Pro Cypher. He's taken a lot of damage. He gets the uh, piercing sight out, but it's for nothing in the end. And still, neither player have taken an item. Until now. That's not an ordinary start, usually a fire rocket launcher without taking items first. Yeah. But I think it was like uh, a risk the Sparty wanted to take because he feels that he wants to punish Visor and kill it before he can get Railgun and stack going on. Hmm. So I think it's no normal decision by Sparty. And Cypher wasn't ready for it. There it is. This Very. is difficult for, for Cypher. Yeah. He's chasing that. Really? That's like the one thing that Sparty could do that would allow Cypher to get away. Yeah. <laughs> but still. Well. Starting Anything. shotgun would help, I think. He has to get the mega Here right is now. Sparty. I'm starting with it. No, actually, on this map, Sparty isn't starting with uh, starting shotgun. That's the machine gun he's got, I think. Yeah. Armor's up. I think he's assumed that he's taken it already. Oh, he finds him in the end. And he really prioritized. All right, get the frag. Finish it off before we and take any more items. Nice shotgun by Cypher. Whoa. Nice shotgun by Cypher. That was really nice. And Sparty missed the rocket. He's usually great at those follow-ups. And he just didn't close it at then. It worries me now because I'm not sure how Sparty performs on these two champions on Blood Covenant. Visor, I mean, he's just died within five seconds of both players. Yeah. Oh, he pushed him with the LG to the totem, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, but it that... wasn't enough anyway. Yeah, he was just did not seem bothered at all that way. <laughs> Fast, harder. I mean, that was a very weird round. We saw a great... <laughs> uh, we saw a great start from Sparty, and then it just kind of collapsed on itself. Now, I'm not Switch used to Switch from start. Cypher. He's like starting him. with Slash now. And I think it's right. Whoa. What? A mid uh, follow-up. 90 damage rocket looking for that preferred rail. He's right below you. Whoa. Oh, oh my is god. Nail gun? That's so painful. Is he still gonna go in? Then LG takes him down. 
But they're, they're, again, they're playing chicken with each other at the moment to see yeah. how the aggression's gonna go down. But I just hope Cypher didn't rage, but because after the snail gun you can easily rage. Yeah, that hurt. Way too much. <laughs> Cypher's opted for nail gun strategy yeah. also. Yeah, he's like, whoa, I forgot. This weapon is really good. This is Interesting a engage. Oh my god, that was close from Sparty. He calculated the health between them very accurately though, because that was almost not an engagement to go into. Yeah, and Mega is a reward for him. And if he'll realize that Cypher didn't pick up heavy, he'll go for it. Yeah, now he for sure knows it. Cypher is just sticking till the end. I don't know why. Just take LG <laughs> for God's sake! And Cypher is not available in happening? What is they doing? The shotgun. A cypher, a Sparty just switched to LG, he would have had that frag. A long oh, time ago. Shotgun too. <laughs> Anything could work. Oh my but God. he just missed every rail at some there point. And it's really interesting that Cypher was sticking to railing while still had the ability all this time. Like he just like, ah. You pushing it? <laughs> yeah, he really was pushing it to the limit. It's no like fear. he knew that his dodge was going to like outplay Sparty. <laughs> yeah, but didn't happen on the six rail shot. No, in a row. I mean, at some point you've got to think. No, Sparty's not gonna miss this one. It's just been too many. Oh, nice usage of what Sparty some doing? Wolf action. Yeah, but Sparty didn't. Use ghost ball. Use ability, yeah. Was he pushing the limits? Yeah. <laughs> and sometimes you don't realize how fast is Visor because when you have Wolha, you have perfect knowledge of where is opponent, and the time you prefire around corners is just insane. Mm. And I think Sparty was greedy, wanted to like shoot one more rocket or something, but it's just not working versus Wolha. Nice. We're finally actually getting a chance to sit back and enjoy seeing Visor being played. And by two insanely good you know, players at the same time. So I'm, I'm curious to see what the kind of piercing sight strategy is. I don't is like be. that Sparty used piercing sight without rail in his hands, but it worked. And he did 200 damage with rockets just by spam. I think part of it though, it might not be, okay, I want to attack with it, but I also want uh, to just know what's going on, so where can I run, what am I dodging for? Yeah. Uh, do you have Paul on Sparty or Cypher? I'm on Cypher right now. Yeah, and I think like Sparty got, I mean Cypher got baited into it, because he had Volhak on, and he wanted to rail, Ooh. and it backfired. Yeah, the pillars there just, set, or whatever it is, like, by the <laughs> archway, saved Cypher. Yeah. Now, but now Cypher is in dangerous position. Because he doesn't have real ammo. Sparty used it, I think. Yeah. <laughs> he might lose the. No, he won't lose the heavy. Sparty didn't overcommit and he's going to go back for it. That's a really fun matchup to watch. It's good, actually. And, and Visor, especially on a map like this, this is probably his best map by far. Yeah. I agree. I think also viable on uh, ruins, would you say? Yeah, ruins, because a lot of uh, cooldown bubbles hmm. and a lot of angles for rail. Oh, he's in trouble right now. He's using the piercing sight just to really make those rockets a bit more effective. But it is going to be Sparty's visor that reigns supreme. One rocket left, and that was one of the weirdest rocket jumps I've ever seen in my life. The ne <laughs> It's just gonna take away the cooldown bubbles. Oh, bye bye, Cypher. It's nice party using proper weapons and not doing any mistake. Whoa. Well, he's got the piercing sight out, but he actually lost time using the LG then because yeah. he has to wait for that ability animation to go down. Oh, that's very brave from Sparty. Oh no, not worth it at all. Sparty with an advantage in a round throws it away again. <laughs> he thinks, why did I pick Galena? <laughs> yeah, it's not been a great pick for him on the map yet. Ash saying, she's showing me weird arrive chance. 
fight. I know Jason Kaplan can too. Don't know if he's around. I'm f he was meant to join today, guys, but he's uh, he's been a bit off. Russell Prolin. Nice shot. Double nice shot. Oh, it goes for the pre-fire as well. Again, just as his uh, piercing sight ended. Still the ghost war. Rail wouldn't kill Sparty, so he can hold on a bit. Cypher gonna get his piercing sight soon. Yeah, he's getting top position again. And what? looking for some rails. What do you think of using piercing sight like this versus Nyx when their ghost walks up? Good. Really? What about yeah. saving it till you force the ghost walk out? You will save it for two. Like, you, you never know. Will you get some initial damage versus Nyx? Hmm. That's like what I can say in my opinion. Like, yeah, it can work. Like, it's really good if you force her ghost walk and then you use piercing sight. But, but I still prefer. Yeah, yeah. I prefer like using it like that, hitting one rail and then somehow force her in ghost walk and you still have time to find her because ghost walk is only three seconds while piercing sight is seven seconds. So you I, still have a room. Yeah, and I guess yeah, what you're saying is that you don't run the risk of being trapped by Nyx when she ghost walks into you. Yeah. Well, there it is. The Cypher's in a lot of trouble at the moment because uh, Sparty takes a direct rocket but elects to go aggressive. And that was carefully calculated. He had just over 100 health. Nice spam rocket by Sparty. Curious if he will give up heavy like that. Really that. Whoa. Nice use of ghost walk right after rail. And escaping. Oh, he went through the teleporter. Party didn't expect that. He just need to survive. Oh my god. Even though Cypher is railable, I don't think it's worth to risk your next life like that. When you're one champion up. Is he gonna try and get onto this heavy? He's gonna have time because Cypher was taking uh, resources elsewhere on the map. Cypher. Oh, wow. Sparta hitting. And Sparta is hitting. It's going everything his way. But he's had great starts to rounds pretty much every single round so far. But yes. it's closing them. And it's Cypher map pick. Don't forget. Yeah, I, I feel as if Sparta should already be in the lead though. Yeah. Overstacked on armor and health. Does get a good read on where Cypher is. Looks for the extra rail. He's leaving the armor up too, but he can't overcommit. I like this move. Like, if he would get some damage, he would just go back to heavy. Have remains a dominant stack. This is very oh brave for God. Cypher. Wow, Sparty Sparty. shoot the frag now, just push with LG. Please push with LG. Even visibility, any help, just push with LG. Push! Come on, How Sparty. is he still alive? Oh my god, he lost that so shotgun. much. <laughs> How much damage did that shotgun do? It was I think like... it was point blank. Jesus Christ. At least, I think so. And now, Slash gonna get heavy control. A little bit. There's only one rocket left. Ghost Wolf is intact. Since Sparty was way too greedy with his ability. Should have used it a lot earlier, but he wanted to hit the trail. His weaponry is crap as well. But no rail. Cypher does. doesn't have rail. Yeah. yeah, that's like a saving grace for him. I don't know if he just took it then. Yeah, Cypher might fail. Jump to rail. Oh my oh. god! <laughs> what a combo there from Sparty. He got the timing on the teleporter exit. Flawless. You know, at that second, I wanted to say that's weird that he is not spamming nail gun because previous time Cypher entered like that, he died because of nail gun spam, basically. Mm. But Cypher, like, Sparty shows that rocket combo was yeah, perfect. It's, it's not just the nail gun that he. he yeah. Used. 
can spawn teleporters with everything. So why aren't you doing plus four of tribal in your games? What? Why don't you plus four of tribal in your games? I do plus four of tribal. And last time we played with Sparta, I did a tribal frag on him. <laughs> I remember it. You remember every single tribal frag you get because there are just generally so few of them. No, in Sacrifice I don't remember because I did billion of them. <laughs> But Tribal is connecting really well in this patch, so... Oh, Cypher has Volkhag. That's another way for it to work really, really well. And that's bad for Sparty. His Nyx has been so useful for him. He needs to make Visor do a lot of work. Otherwise, I feel like if he goes to Galena, it's gonna be GG. Yeah. Oh my god. Good Spot little G damage. Heaven. Uh, sorry, Sparty really holding on down by those pillars. There's not much my Cypher can do with this information though, unfortunately for him. S but Cypher used the, his wall hack and he didn't get any success. Yeah, I'm and Sparty has now. opportunity to get uh, rail now. And... He's probably using... So now Sparty oh, okay. can do something. Yeah, I'm watching Cypher's perspective, but I, I think... But both players have generally been using their wall hack Almost immediately. Yeah. But both of them are playing Whoa. defensively, that it's not giving like any edge. But now Sparty hitting a rocket plus rail combo and he should push for a frag. Good job by Sparty. Slightly risky with the rail, but yeah, makes it work. So all good. Yeah. But he needed that frag. So it's very risk to take. For a mid air to get something done. Interesting jumps. LG Interesting. Oh wow. no. What? Sparty has Volkhack on, right? Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. I just was watching from Cypher point of view and why I was surprised how aware Sparty is. It, it came Volhack up. It all. Yeah. So the Ghost Walk was used and then like a second later the Volhack was up. No more LG ammunition! Hits the rail. He needs to hit one more. Is he gonna come back in? He's mental. Oh, finds oh. the rail shot. Sparty. He's gonna take the first map in the series. Damn. Uh, I thought he's done there when he was pushed by LG so well by Cipher. Yeah, when his LG ran out, I was like, God, yeah. because you have those high pressure rails that you've got to hit, and they're they're probably the hardest. Yeah. But also, like, after Sparty hit rail, I saw Cypher decide, okay, I will back off, I'll get everything on pillars, we'll get Mega. But he decided, no, I will mm. go to the end. And it didn't work, Sparty hit again. Absolutely mad. Ah, Christ, God, I just realized that the map scores are wrong. That was the first map in the series, uh, gents, so my apologies for deceiving you there. We did say if he went to the Galena, he was going to lose, but... Yeah, vi yeah it all. best tactic, just don't go to Galena then. <laughs> uh, second map is starting uh, any second, guys. Uh, it is Corrupted Keep? No, Veil. Vale. We've got Veil, vale, and this is Sparty's map pick. Prepare for draft. All right. I'm expecting Galenas, I'm expecting Slags and Nixes, I think. Maybe Stink. something else instead of Sorlag. Cypher really likes Veil. What? Cypher plays a lot of Clutch in 2v2. Cypher's got a great uniform as well with his champions. You see the color coordination he's got here going on? This is what yeah. you guys need to aspire to. This is how you... Mine are best. <laughs> What's yours? Actually, though? best Clutch I ever saw in my life is close skin. He just never plays it. Oh really? Like he was playing it only when he was accidentally locking it in sacrifice practice and you couldn't switch. <laughs> but like, his clutch is awesome. Alright, let me update those map scores properly for you guys now. It is one map up for Sparty. 
Fight me. Right, let me review. So they've both got Nexus. Sparty's gone for Visor. What? Well, maybe he felt that Galena didn't work well enough. And he decided to. That he doesn't feel that Galena works versus Cypher or something like that. It's possible. Because Cypher always used to use. Galena, before Galena was even part of the meta, I s yeah. Cypher tried to force him into the meta somehow. But on the other hand, Cypher picked Clutch, and Wiser is not good thing versus Clutch. Mm. Round one. True. I'm on Sparty to begin with, with Solak going up versus Galena. Got to assume there's going to be a totem after that exit, otherwise it's just simply too good to be true. Oh my god, the LG, the standstill dodge as well from Cypher. Launch yourself through the teleporter and hope that this brings you a better life. Can you use speed here? Speed, Sparty. If he would use speed before that rocket, I think it would be perfect. Oh my god. Uh, it's so tight though, he doesn't want to get hit by any extra damage. Uh, uh, Sorry, I'm just trying to mimic some nice. sounds. You like to think I did it well? Yeah, it's like almost identical. <laughs> oh, we've lost it now. Little does anyone know that I actually did the voiceovers for Sorlag. You're a female. Well, no, I'm a dinosaur. Hmm. You didn't read the sort of like lore. The uh, lore? Lore, you, yeah. You clearly have. No, I didn't, but I'm trying to act like I did. <laughs> There's no totem on the exit there. We're hitting, seeing directs everywhere from Cypher. And he's going to secure himself the first frag on Veil. It's really tough. When Galena have totems all over the top. Sparty using the ability to destroy the totems. What the hell? Go for Mega, but it didn't work. As he wanted for sure. Can you get away? No. That's a no. And now it's the visor. I'm actually gonna switch over to Sparty, because I really want to see how he uses visor over here. It's just an unusual champion to see on Battle Map. Whoa, the rocket was close. Oh, the door closed and he lost his angle. He can't go through the teleporter. Really? There's no totem? Oh, it's not. Exactly he destroyed it previous time and he saw that uh, Cypher placed it not on the teleporter exit after the oh, fight. You just looked but at now him! now he thought... <laughs> okay. I justified him that he remember such moments, but after looking on it, he forgets it. Okay. <laughs> he says he didn't mean to go in, but it, it looked... Looked a little bit weird. Yeah. He probably didn't mean to go to it after he already did. <laughs> he was like realizing, oh no, what did I do? <laughs> it happens quite often. Life is suffering there a bit. I see someone asking what part of the tournament is that this is the, whoa, the winner bracket semi final. Oh winner no, Sparty. No. What, what the are hell? You doing? I think it's something that Vale does. It just makes you play. Just like a mentalist. No, he didn't play like that versus Garpy. His Nyx was very defensive. And, well, <laughs> and here he just pushing non stop in the teleporter. What? Cypher? Why he used Wallhack if his opponent just died? But he didn't know. Like, what? <laughs> What's, What's going happening? on? That was his last champion as well. I turned. There's, don't worry about this, guys. I think we're gonna go to a third map. It all started we'll after you. Yeah, it all started because of you was trying to make Sorlok -like sound after the everything <laughs> fell apart. Round three. Blame me, not the players. God damn it. Yes. <laughs> Through the teleporter again, Sparty? Yeah, of course. No! What the. <laughs> No, he must be trolling right now. <laughs> he can't do this like with his every champion all the time. 
He's done it. Yeah, he has done it with every single one now. At least yeah. once. If Sparty gets this frag... Okay, don't do this. I don't know what I was going to dare myself to do, but... It would have been a miracle. <laughs> he went again, by the way. The Cypher put him like one second too late. That's just... I, I don't understand. I thought he was going to run into it again. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he avoids the rail. He's got a chance now. But no. <laughs> okay. I hope he go TP now. Please. Please. Oh, he's finally okay. got a kill on the Galena. Nice. But it's Visor. Like, what the hell is he meant to do with this? Oh my god. Uh oh. Stay down, bounce pad. Well, he does, and he gets the kill. That from was it. really fast. <laughs> that was really fast. Like, we can forget all the clutch moments from Sparty on DM6. <laughs> You're like, oh, my map pick. Now I'm gonna show you how it's done. <laughs> what, lose it almost as fast as base lost to Razy on Blood Run. Yeah. Yeah, I got nothing, guys. That was a weird map. <laughs> Uh, also, I think that Cypher's very good at that map. I mean, before we go into that, I'm not, like, making that uh, conclusion after seeing this, but I've always felt that there's been something about that map that Cypher's adapted very well to. And his Galena's just great anyway. So, whoever wins this next map, guys, is going to go versus Razy in the winner bracket final. When I say winner bracket, it means yes, there's still games going down in the loser bracket. I don't know how far we are through it. We'll check it out after this map. But um, we're probably just a handful of games away from concluding this tournament. And it is 7.15pm UK time. Right, Galena picked by Cypher. That's something ordinary. Please don't pick Visor, Sparty. Next standard, or maybe he is going to go clutch. So we've seen three players using clutch today. Uh, Razy, Cypher, and Garpy. And Sparty. <laughs> and look at that skin. We've, we could see the skin on the, on the clutch. <laughs> Check it out, guys. Well, it's interesting. <laughs> Wait, let, let's see. I want, I want to see Sparty's lineup. It's my, it might show Cypher's lineup, which I'm going to be very upset by. Oh, we're not going to see it at all? Oh, maybe Only after winning. Maybe at the end of warm up. I just want to see. You will see it after. It, he, he, lineup of the winner. Yeah, there's a game. Or if Sparty will hover over. Uh, clutch. Last yeah. 10 seconds before starting. It's the only thing I really want to see right now. Come on, Sparty. Damn it, I can't see it. Yeah, ah! he's showing Nyx. Oh! oh, oh. Three, there we go. <laughs> Let's go, guys. I am on Cypher's point of view to begin with. We are getting a clutch versus clutch Power Ranger City battle. And that is the most visible champion possible right now in the whole game. It's just how oh, this flash mirror works, baiting shield. Oh, it doesn't <laughs> go through the shield. What the hell are yeah. we looking at? No mid air, but he finds the rocket down at the bottom. Cypher with first blood. Life is gonna what? be vulnerable, so this is a chance. Why he didn't jump to heavy? I, I thought Cypher will go to heavy, but he. I'm not sure. Did go. And now, oh, oh, he almost pushed him out of the map, but he finishes him off with the machine gun. So that was nice from Sparty. Clutches are out of the game. I wonder if Sparty can challenge on this heavy. No. Oh, does get a bit of damage afterwards. Rockets are... Uh, Alright. Oh my god, he's barely alive. I think he heard that the Ghost Walk was used. Yeah. Oh no, not what? like this Sparty. Massive damage. 
Oh, spotted. Rip. The nail gun does a teeny bit. Spotted's gonna try and come in on this. Spit. Not only damage over time lands, and it's gonna be another mid air for Cypher to clean up round one. Prepare to fight. Sparty throwing. <laughs> round begins in. I think we're gonna see another clutch fight. Two. One. Round two. Fight. I kind of like the star animation for clutch, actually. It's kind of cool. No clutch to begin with for Sparty, actually. What? These little flick mid-airs are really, really sick. I think they're both going to exchange on the time shards. Surely, I want one. I'm not sure why Sparty's there. Uh, he's probably going to go Sawlag now to clean up the frag. Well, I'll clean up. Only 10 seconds available for that, so it's not that easy. Should be able to do it though. Yeah, machine gun too strong. Oh. But still, Cypher did a lot of damage and now he can do some attack with Nyx. Well, we're trying to get away now. Oh, just about gonna make it. Items up about five seconds or so. <laughs> Look at Sparty. His movement really, really, really sucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Like, that's, that's bad. That's really... What the hell? Oh, I, I, I think now, now I know why he said that he could, like, his plus forward crouch acceleration didn't work. He for sure is doing something wrong. Oh! What? <laughs> what are you doing, Sparty? <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, you're, you're right, because he... Flew out the map on a couple of occasions with Sawlag and... Yeah, yeah. Oh, he had the stream on in the background. <laughs> but... Sparty, amateur. Amateur. <laughs> but... <laughs> like, it, it's like, like impossible. Because first of all, you're hearing double sound. Secondly, you hear... Uh, our talking some bullshit. He probably muted play, it. Like 10 seconds. I suspect he just had it muted. Ah, that. that's why he had FPS drops, right? Yeah, I think so. Ah, yeah, that, that explains. Well, as I said, it's your fault. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's it. Yeah. It's not like it would be weird trying to stream snipe the, the no, stream. No, no, of course not stream snipe. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. But I wouldn't be surprised if Sparty would say, Ah, I hear double sound. That's why I can't understand what's going on on the map. <laughs> you know? I was thinking about that. But for sure, like, stream sniping is not possible in Quake at all because... Because, like, yeah. even three seconds delay, it's already GG. Yeah, it's way too much. And that is an absolute steamrolling on Corrupted Keep. I don't really know what we watched on Vale or uh, on Corrupted Keep, but... It does mean we get a Cypher versus Razy winner bracket final, which you know what? I'm not bloody unhappy about. Because that should be a really, really cool series. God damn it, Sparty. <laughs> Who wanna get tutorial of sort of like movement by Sparty? Sub to Zota. <laughs> Sparty, I'm giving free uh, sort of like movement tutorials. If um, you'd like to sign up, message me on Discord. We can arrange a time and a date. <laughs> Yeah. How to not get out of the map. How to control yourself in the air. <laughs> Sorry, I feel like we're being I'm being really condescending, but I enjoy that too much. Are you hanging around with me for the winner bracket finals? You, am I providing you with a sufficient entertainment? <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Yeah? Awesome. Yeah. I'm glad. So Cypher got the two one in the end. Actually that was what the Fewest of people bet on also. Oh, God damn it, I was close. I was really close. Uh, I think then we're going over to a... Uh...